Now to breaking news. Fire crews are battling a brush fire burning in Highland Park. Gil Lavis is overhead in Sky 5 with the details. Gil. Pedro and Sheriff, it's a fast moving fire that's burning uphill in some pretty heavy brush. We're looking at about five acres of fire that has burned. Uh, it started about 9.50 this evening with uh, the fire starting down uh, the hill here. This is right along the 110 freeway at Avenue 60. Now the fire department, when they arrived on scene, they uh, initially had about an acre, but it started spreading uphill. And they were saying, they were talking about this fire potentially starting with fireworks. And Area. So right now it has grown up to, like I said, about five acres. The L.A. City Fire Department's on scene from the ground and in the air. They're responding several water dropping helicopters. We've seen at least one drop happen here in the last minute or so. But you can see it's uh, burning uphill in a quick uh, pace. At the top of the hill, there's some homes there. This is going to be the 6200 block of Monterey Road. They have uh, fire crews heading up there to do structure protection on those homes there. But let me come down to the side of the uh, hill where this started, and you can see what the, the fire department's dealing with. You can see the, gr the very dry grass there and the, the brush in between. You see firefighters hiking up the hill to, to fight that fire on the ground. And like I said, they have water dropping helicopters in the area that have been uh, dropping water on this fire. But again, along the 110 freeway at Avenue 60, the CHP was talking about shutting down the freeway at a time, but you can see there's still tr uh, traffic. Now let's go to some uh, cell phone footage that was uh, shot from people driving on that 110 freeway of this fire when it first broke out. Again, uh, pretty heavy lengths of uh, flame here burning on two two fronts here and you can see that cell phone video of uh, people driving by this fire once it's first started but again very dramatic footage there but again back to the scene out here as i zoom in let me come into a little tighter so you can see the heavy brush that they were talking about you can see it there in the screen as i zoom in here and uh, show you that those flame lengths but right now the fire department doing what they can to stop this fire from burning out of control that's the very latest overhead in Sky 5. I'll send it back to you in the studio. Yeah, Gil, um, again, uh, there were questions about whether they were going to shut down the freeway here at the 110 at Avenue, um, at Avenue 60. Is that what you said? Yeah, it's Avenue 60. Now it's burning on the, this would be the south side of the freeway or the east side of the freeway, they're saying. Uh, so it is uh, burning uh, towards the, uh, I, I guess you could say the Cypress uh, Hills uh, or the El Sereno area. Uh, and not uh, towards the uh, Highland Park area. But this is actually considered Highland Park right in here. But uh, you can see the fire department, they're doing what they can. Let me come out wider and show you some access over here. You can see some more fire crews over here in this area here. They're staging at that location and trying to get crews into the neighborhood above at the top of the, uh, the hillside. That's where they're going to do those that structure protection for those homes up there. Yeah, and Gil, uh, we were talking to Vera earlier today, and she said you know, the wind's aren't necessarily that strong tonight. You don't see the smoke going in one direction necessarily, but still when you have so much dry brush in the area, the fire could spread and you really hope that it's it's not fireworks because this is what uh, the city has been warning. The county has been warning for so, so many days now is to not use fireworks and it's for reasons like this. We have very dry brush in the area um, and this is when you get one of these fires that start. They can spread very quickly. So fire crews right now on the scene trying to protect homes in the area again uh, near Monterey Road. This is in the Highland Park off the 110 freeway uh, started with just one acre burning. Now it's at five acres and continues to grow. There you can see a oh, water drop from the there. LA City Fire Department right there, dropping on that one flank. That's the that would be the uh, western flank of the fire. Nice drop right on that oh, fire uh, line there and uh, dousing that. But again, here's the concern. Let me zoom in. You see that uh, flame length there, and here's some homes just above uh, that uh, hillside there. The fire hasn't reached that brush yet, but it's very close, and that's the real concern right now for those homes up there on the top on Monterey Road. Gil, do you see any hand crews? Yeah, let me zoom in here, Pedro. You can see some of the crews here. It's a little difficult to see right in there. You see some of the firefighters with their uh, hose lines. They're trying to make it, make their way up the hill. And uh, right in there, you can see one of them. I, we did see him putting some water on that flames, on those flames right there a minute ago. But uh, they're definitely trying to get up that hill. It's very steep, a lot of uh, tall grass and heavy brush. And that's the concern for firefighters right now. Uh, fortunately, the winds are not strong, like you mentioned, uh, Pedro and Sherry. You can see it's not really uh, uh, pushing the fire uh, very much to the left or to the right, but it is 
on those two flanks right now. And the big concern is at the top of the hill. Yeah, certainly, uh, you know, trying to get this uh, fire under control with those water dropping helicopters. Um, you know, these these fires, if uh, they don't get them under control, tend to have their own weather pattern and and could develop, uh, you know, those uh, fire nados as we've seen um, in the past and erupt and explode into something much bigger than the five acres it is right now. Uh, we want to bring Vera Jimenez into the picture here and talk a little bit about what the uh, firefighters conditions um, are uh, on this evening here in Monterey in Highland Park. Vera. Eric, it's actually uh, relatively mild at this point. Uh, the temperatures aren't that hot. We do have mostly clear skies, as you can see from Gil's picture, but uh, the temperature is sitting right around 70 degrees. So it's upper 60s, low 70s, which again, you know, they're definitely going to be warm because of the uniforms and the protective gear that they wear. But by and large, it's not that hot. Uh, the humidity is also sitting at 28%, and that, of course, is going to continue to increase during the overnight hours as we see the onshore flow get a little bit stronger. The winds at this point are in the single digits. They're relatively calm, as you can see, by the wind pattern, or excuse me, by the smoke pattern coming off of that fire. Uh, but we are going to see winds, if they do pick up, at around maybe seven miles per hour out of the southeast. So again, nothing terribly dramatic. Uh, so it's the weather at this point isn't going to hinder the firefight, and that is always very important. Uh, we don't have any fire watches or warnings. There was an earlier wind advisory, but it's for Santa Barbara County. And so that is along the coast. Um, other than that, uh, the, the the weather pattern isn't going to be bad. Isn't going to be at least uh, spreading this fire too bad. And you can see as Gil just pulled out, uh, the smoke is just kind of sitting right over the, the fire and just yeah. slowly drifting, drifting away. And obviously the main concern here is that the fire doesn't reach the homes that are behind at the top of the hill here. But Gil, I'm curious, what kind of impact is this having on traffic? Are you seeing long lines on the 110? You know, Pedro, I was expecting to see the freeway shut down the way they were talking about it at first, but you can see it burned away from the uh, freeway right now. So th I think they felt that the freeway was safe at this point. The fire was pushing away and uphill from the from the freeway. So right now it's actually moving uh, fairly smoothly. There's a the northbound 110 seems to be impacted a little bit coming away from the five freeway. But once uh, traffic gets here, it looks like it's flowing pretty good. Uh, I can show you back up at the top. There's going to be a water drop here in a second. But the fire crews up here uh, with these homes, they're setting up their structure protection groups there uh, to protect those homes. And you see one of the uh, LA City Fire Helicopter 2 coming in to uh, set up maybe for another water drop here. But it's starting to look better on that right flank or that's, uh, that western flank, the northern flank here. This is uh, the stubborn part of the fire right now. And they want to make sure this gets controlled fairly soon because it is very close to those homes. Yeah, it certainly is. Uh, the last thing that we want to um, see here is, is have anybody's uh, home or properties, um, you know, the, uh, destroyed. Um, again, this started at about 9.50. Uh, and the, this is a, at the 6200 block of Monterey Road, right off the 110 at the um, Avenue 60 exit. Uh, you know, we, we've had some water dropping helicopters uh, that have made some progress on this fire. The fire now at five acres right now. And we'll keep you updated. We're going to take a quick break, but stay with us. We'll keep you updated on this fast-moving brush fire.